home from the strawberry farm exhausted I ate too much food so I'm in a food coma but I watch uh, my girls Bridget and Holly on the girls next level um, they were I don't want to give too much away because you got to join their patreon but they were talking about um, how us girls would come down to dinner in our pajamas with no makeup looking like crap and it was interesting to hear their perspective on it they were like they thought they were okay to look like crap like with well in our words but we didn't look like crap I think we look spectacular but anyway meaning no effort no makeup hair in a bun and wearing the community uh, pajamas because in their words they thought like everyone that was there for dinner were like oh look at the girls are so disheveled they had such a wild night with half oh he sets the man oh they partied all night oh i wonder the juicy details and it was interesting to hear that perspective because i had a different perspective and it wasn't like my perspective it was kind of what I saw others projecting. And I'm not talking about Holly and Bridget. I'm talking about the other girls. When they would come down to dinner, which is very rarely, but when they would come down to see half at dinner or make an appearance, they would wear the community pajamas, which I loved. I wish I kept. With no makeup, hair in a bun, looking disheveled. Now, this was my take on it. I thought they came down like that as more of a possession to show everyone there, male or female, or prospective females that wanted to be girlfriends or whatever, that they spent the night, that they live at the mansion to establish. I live here. I'm wearing my pajamas. I don't have any makeup. Meaning, I live here. I'm someone. Respect me. I have pull. I have power. I live here. Because anyone else at the Playboy Mansion would be in normal attire and have makeup or put together. But if they're wearing pajamas no makeup, hair in a bun, look like they just got up. That meant that they slept there. They have a room there. They're established to respect them and to fear. So that was my perception of it when I acknowledge other girls doing that. And I've done it too, maybe for the same reasons because it never occurred to me to be like, oh, we just had a wild night and I just couldn't put myself together. In a little bit, I didn't do it that drastically. But a little bit, well, first of all, I'm, I'm just a lazy girl and I'm just, as you can tell, I like, this is how I am anyway in normal life. But in a way, I would come down like that, like this is my normal life. I live here. I'm established, like, not to put fear in anybody, but just let the people know, like, hey, I'm, I'm a girlfriend. It was kind of like wearing, a, like, a name tag saying, Stacy Burke, Hef's girlfriend, I live here, you know. Um, I guess for a little bit of respect or for people to, to kind of acknowledge me or, or, you know, just, I don't know. But mainly is for comfort to be honest to be for comfort because I didn't have to get dressed it was nice and those pajamas were comfortable but I noticed it in the other girls that that's why they did it that's why they did it to show the other Sunday fun day girls or whoever girls that come around like you got to go through me first I live here obviously I sleep here I have a room I am a resident here at the Playboy Mansion and and kind of just tell it just wearing a uniform like I want to have girls watch out watch your back respect me get out of my way don't mess with me 
you know, or, you know, or whatever their motives were. But that was my take on it. So, anyway. I'll probably put this in a video, like, but I just wanted to put that out there. Peace. <laughs>